I, you know, I'll tell you, I'm going to make a confession to you right now. There are two psychopaths, you know what, I, 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 I tell people to have no contact ever again. There are two people in my life, on the periphery of my life now, that I know, don't know I've written the book, and don't know anything about me other than some guy who lives down the road, who I absolutely know are both psychopaths, but I keep them around me casually as almost like control specimens. I use them to, to see how they react to certain social changes, certain, uh, certain, you know, just even, I've even, actually, <laughs> seasonal changes. I have this, this new anecdotal body of evidence that's building that there are certain times of year when the psychopathic frenzy becomes more active. But the, that, that I, these people have not known I've written the book. I have not changed my demeanor about them. However, I find they're, I'm finding it more and more difficult to have them stay in my company for any more than a minute. So it's almost like they know, I know, and you know, and uh, the only time I, I got one of them, I got one of them to say at least a, a cloud of drink in the pub one night, I bought him, I was buying pints of, pints of beer on my, and I was drinking soft drinks, and I, was, I just wanted to watch him, and it was, I was just pretending that I casually walked into the pub and there he was, but I went in with this specific thing to actually study him, that this guy, as he got more and more drunk, his psychopathic tendencies came more and more out, to the point where he starts saying things like, uh, oh, everybody in this town thinks I'm a complete cunt, but let me tell you, I'm smarter than all of them. Uh, and inside of me, I feel perfect. I feel perfect. I can't explain it. I was drunk when he said this, but I feel perfect. I feel like I'm better than anyone, and I can do anything. And when you hear this one, Jacob, then he says to me, you know what I feel like? I feel like a puzzle, and I I can put all the people. That's the actual term he used. I feel like a puzzle, and I can put you know like a jigsaw puzzle, and I put all the pieces together, and I know I'm fucking great. Can you believe that? Yeah, it's just. There's weird. nothing about the guy who lives up the road. So right. I'm sort of violating the no contact thing, but it's just pure. It's purely because I, I I can handle it now. I can deal with them. Now I'm on to the next level, how to actually, what to do with them. Because, uh, as you brought up, you know, but I, there are things I'm starting to get, building a body of anecdotal evidence on, in terms of they seem to be very, very uh, controlled by natural forces in the world. I'm talking about, you know, natural cycles, like seasonal cycles and so on. They seem to have, they seem to always embark on their psychopathic rampages in spring. This is when they either come out the closet, devastate people, or move on to their next target. Well, they can move a winter long. You've coiled, so, you've coiled with the with the predatory behavior, right? That's also when predators go uh, uh, crazy because that's when there's young ones. Yeah. Right. Well, it's, it's like a, 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 the way certain viruses don't come, become active until the weather is warm. Yeah, but uh, and, and and there's uh, there's not an abundance of uh, uh, either. Um, weakened old ones from the former uh, season or yep. new young ones these are the the uh, the, the peri periods that um, a psychopath would come out I would also expect them to uh, kind of go on a rampage in and around um, uh, winter time really um, early winter where, where yeah November would... November no this people have annoyed me saying to me that they've done they've done things like commit murders or went into commit their main fraud. It seems to be that the the deception and the lies and the manipulation happens in spring, and the attack happens in late autumn, early winter. Yes. Yes. It's the strangest thing. No, it so makes sense. that's when. No, it does make sense because they're an animal. They're really like an animal. So they. Whoa. Place. Oh, well, we're falling out. Hang on. Grooming their next target, which they would pounce in on the following spring. It's just fascinating how they're. This is all coming out now. How they're actually. You, you, there's actually traits. This is see. This this is when they start boasting about how smart and clever they are, 
and how they're the next stage in evolution, but they're still, in terms of their behavior, in the world. <laughs> You know, they're, they're, they're a step backwards, really. You know, they haven't learned how to work with nature. They've learned how to, they're still completely dominated by it.